Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In this one, I'll be showing you how I can create the gun flash that you have just saw in the intro. Starting out on my timeline, I have a video footage which is running on a slow motion. And this video footage is downloaded from Artlist. Link in the description, which you can get two months for free. Now moving on, I can see that the video is on slow motion, so I'm gonna speed up a little bit by pressing Ctrl R and decreasing the length. Then I'm choosing this moment and I'm leaving a marker. This is the place where the fire is gonna happen. So I'm getting this image and I'm leaving it over the marker. And this gun flash, you can get it from Google simply by tapping gun flash or muzzle flash and you can download the image for free. Now I'm counting five frames forward and I'm gonna cut the remaining because I'm gonna need it just for five frames. So I'm grabbing the end of it and I'm dragging it until the timeline hit. Then I'm highlighting it and I'm selecting this transfer icon right here so I can resize it. I'm grabbing one of the corners and I'm pulling it towards the middle so I can resize it. Then I'm grabbing it and reposition around the gun. They go in the inspector on compulsive mode, I'm selecting screen. That way I'm getting rid of all of the background. Then I reposition it again and I'm tilting the fire a little bit too forward since the gun is not holding straight. And since the footage is not still, it's moving, I need to make a few keyframes to make the gun fire in the right place. I'm selecting the top keyframe and I'm moving one frame at a time. And with each frame, I'm adjusting the fire in front of the gun. And when I'm done, I'm gonna preview it, so I'm sure that it's on the right place. Next step is bringing some life into the footage by adding some sound effects. And this sound effect I also got from Artlist, which if you use my link in the description, you'll get two months for free. I'm repositioning the sound effect and I'm cutting the parts that I'm not needing. Then I'm previewing. Another thing I forgot to mention, you can select this gun flash which you have just added, which is the picture from Google. You can go to inspector, on compulsive mode, you can decrease and increase the opacity. I'm gonna leave mine on 90%, that's all depending on your footage. What's next is that I'm gonna put these footsteps. So I'm taking and leaving it on video slot number two, and then I'm gonna preview to see if they are matching. I notice they are a little bit faster, so I'm right clicking, change clip speed and then decreasing the speed to about 80%. Now they're matching the footsteps of the character, so I'm leaving it like this. And I'm gonna take down the length of that footsteps until the shoot happen. Then I'm gonna use this background music. Which music I also got from Artlist. I'm leaving it on video slot number 3, reducing the volume by a tiny bit. And this is what I have. Also make sure to watch this video right here, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.